Hey everyone welcome to my channel. Open Blender, delete the default scene, add images as plane and rotate the image and adjust the position and scale. Then add a ground plane. Now split the window, open shader editor, and delete diffuse and the transparent shader of the image. Now search for principal BSDF shader and add it in the editor. Now add a map node, and connect image texture to one of the input values and the output to the alpha of the principal BSDF. Change the blend type of the map node to greater than. Make sure Alpha Blend is selected in Blend Mode if you are using EV Renderer. Now add an Emission Shader and Mix Shader in the editor and connect the output of Principal BSDF Find Emission Shader to the two inputs of the Mix Shader. Connect the output of map node to factor of mix shader. Change emission color and play with values of math node. Also enable bloom effect from setting to get glow for the emission shader. Now for the coding effect, add a plane, scale, rotate and UV unwrap it. Then open shader editor by splitting the window. In the shader editor, add an image texture and select the image from the drive. Now follow similar steps from the previous image. If you haven't subscribed to my channel consider subscribing. And hit the bell icon for the latest videos. For the code running effect, add texture coordinates and mapping node in the editor. You can do this quickly by enabling Node Wrangler add-on. Change the Y location value in Mapping node, and then add keyframes. Here, the animation of code running does not look realistic, as in real life the code execution delays in between the lines. So to achieve that type of animation, Open Graph Editor and select the keyframes, click on V key and change the key interpolation to Vector. Go to Modifiers, and add Step Interpolation Modifier. Change the step size to get the delaying animation effect. Add a camera and set the position of the camera, however you like. And play with the depth of fields, so that the logo is in focus. Duplicate the coding effect plane few times, and arrange them in different locations in the 3D space. Change color and randomize sizes of few of them, and offset the animation. Duplicate the plane few more times, and add keyframes to the camera position to get the result. 